Joining me just now is the big king himself, Jack Jester. Now there has been a lot of action from you this evening after your defeat by Grado as Galloway interfered, you interfering in Galloway's match against Sha Samuels. What is going on and when is this going to end? Well two can play that game. Over three shows, three matches, I've counted two interferences from Drew and more chair shots than I can even think of. Now, I'm no stranger to pain. I'm no stranger to getting beat up, but I must admit I'm starting to get quite fed up. Really, really fed up. Now, I'm not going to see Drew for a while, but that doesn't change the fact that every time I stand up, sit down, turn my head, try and tie my shoelaces, I'm reminded of him. Whether it be the fluid in my elbow, the cracked ribs, or the bruises on my forearms from trying to protect myself from chairs, it's just not on. Now, I don't want to come to work every day not knowing what to expect. Every time I turn round, Galloway's there, arms spread out, hood up, looking mysterious, like a messiah. Galloway's not the messiah. He is just an egotistical, self-centered, delusional big bastard. So here's what I suggest. We get back to where it all started. Me, Drew Galloway, and the venue that we sold out, the venue we made history, the venue that we wrestled, one of the most monumental matches in ICW history, we take it back to the Barrowlands Ballroom. My hometown, Glasgow City Centre, and we're gonna finish it like Glaswegians, Drew. No interferences, no jumping. Two men face to face, one man, left standing, one man lying in the pool of his own blood. Who's it going to be? I can't tell you that. I can tell you one thing, I've got a lot more in my collection than just a steel chair, pal. Now, I've had quite a hard night and I, I'm finished. If you don't mind, I'm going to go drink quite a lot of beer. Understandable. So much beer.